Welcome, my name is Abi Odom from Kautech Academy. In this video, we'll be looking at how to add text to your slides. In order to work with PowerPoint, you will actually need to open the PowerPoint program. In order to open the PowerPoint program, all you have to do is to go to your start menu. For me, I have already opened the PowerPoint, but I will take you through on how you can open your PowerPoint from your computer. In order to open your PowerPoint, go to Start Page or just press the keyboard of the Windows on your computer. There you will see the PowerPoint version you have on your computer. And if you cannot see it on the Start menu, all you just have to do is to type PowerPoint in the Search Programs and Files. There you have your PowerPoint program. Just take your cursor on it and click on it and it will open up your PowerPoint. For me, as I said earlier, I already have the PowerPoint open. But when your PowerPoint opens up, it will give you the option to choose which layout you want. And in most instances, you want to go with blank presentation. So just click on it. So there you have your PowerPoint. The next thing you want to do is actually to start imputing text on it put images and other effects that you want on your PowerPoint and any other information you will likewise need. To impute your text, just ensure that the home tab is active. Click on the drop down beside the new slide, in which case this black triangle beside the new slide. Then go down and click on blank slide. We have other options here. You have the title slide, title and content. All these are other layouts that are available. But in most instances, you want to start from the blank slide layout. So I'll just click on blank layout. And for me to work with what I just brought out now, I can go ahead and delete the first slide. All you just need to do is to press delete on your keyboard or right click and press delete slide. So there you have a blank slide. The blank slide works just fine and it gives us a clean slate to work with. So in order for us to impute our text on this PowerPoint slide, all you have to do is to go to the insert tab, click on it. And then when you navigate towards the text segments, you will see our text box. So let's click on this text box. And when you click on it, you actually see that the cursor has changed. So in order for us to write any text on this PowerPoint slide, we have to hold down the left click, then you drag and draw a rectangle on the blank slide. Thereafter, you can see the cursor blinking inside the text box we have just drawn. You can write whatever you like or whatever you want inside it. And also, if you don't have anything to write, you can actually paste content from another document inside here. For me, I'll just write a simple text here. Once I'm done now, we can format this text any way we want. In order to format this text, you can click on the edge of this text box. And another way to format every content inside the text box is to click inside the text box and select all the content inside. But for this demonstration, either way we go is the same. Let me just click on the edge of the text box. So what we want to do now is to change some of the properties of this text. We can change the theme font to use, let's say, Aharoni. And also we can change the size. And I can change this to 32 points for readability. Just play around with all these settings. You can see what all this works for. Just by hovering on all these options, you can see the way it changes the content. So whatever that works for you, maybe I'll just change this one back to Arial. So for this font size, sometimes you might want to impute a font size that is not here. All you just need to do is to ensure that this box inside the number is highlighted. If it's not highlighted, just click inside it. Then you can impute the number you want. 
maybe for this let me just change it to 34 points so once we are done and you like the number you can just press enter and you see that the content has actually changed on the slide also you can change the font color by going to this area where you have the font color i can click on that dark triangular shape and it will give me options of colors that we have here so by hovering on any of this color you will see the content changing so for this let me just settle for this dark blue so you can play around with all these settings to see what actually works for you once you are satisfied with the formatting we can actually drag this box to any section we want it to be also let me just quickly make a title for this slide so let me just do a little formatting to this. I can actually copy the formatting that is here by clicking on the edge of this test box. I can go to Format Painter. And when I apply it on this upper title, you can see that it has changed it and they are having the same property now. So for our title, I can just decide to make it bold to contrast it from the body. It is possible for you to have as many text box as possible on your slide. There's no restriction to the number of text box you can actually create for your slide. So this is a convenient and simple way to add text to your slide. This is the end of this video. Please share this video to others who might need it. And of course, if you have any inquiry, please reach me on the number that you are seeing on the screen now. Thank you.